muchacha, tengo a todas las manos, hermano. He who has talked to one should not eat as well. This year, I'm on examining the issue of uh, the importance of the needs of the body in order uh, to maintain the needs of the soul. There is a practice we do in this diocese for over nine years now, which we call Men's Sana in Corpore Sano, a healthy mind in a healthy body. It is now very common for many of us to become pastors, to become preachers, to become everything, to get married. But we must work. So I am promoting agriculture. I am promoting artisanship. It's not my first time just finishing your school and then sitting down going about with files. Make a little, a little farm around yourself. Plant little things that can keep you. We have seen foreign aid, foreign um, materials are becoming exorbitant. And with what is happening now in the West, especially in Europe, it's going to be more. I believe that Jesus Christ himself was a carpenter in order to feed. He did not just go about begging. Many of us have become mendicants, going about begging without doing anything. He who refuses to walk um, should be refused to eat. Try to do something. To do something. I've researched that even the central bank is trying to look into agricultural sectors to see how we can get out of the oil boom, the oil um, uh, uh, well that is killing us because that oil is becoming very relevant. I wish every one of us a very grace filled Lenten season and a very joyous Easter season. And Almighty God bless you, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. <laughs>